Hey, it's Two Siders here. Today we are reforging the Golden Seal, and even if we aren't, we will give our best try. We will throw ourselves into the fray and we will give our best try um, at reforging it. Last time we failed, unfortunately. <clears throat> now, uh, before we begin the game, I wanted to talk a couple minutes about um, self promotion on uh, Reddit. But um, I will put a timestamp in the uh, video timeline so you can skip ahead if you'd like. You don't have to listen to it. And uh, also in the meantime, it's kind of funny, but I uh, I am cooking a stew. <laughs> we have to make sure that it doesn't uh, boil over or whatever it's called. It doesn't spill out. So I guess we'll have to micromanage an extra thing in this game this time around. Well, uh, anyways... Um, I've been posting the videos I make on this uh, small channel on the uh, Reddit Against the Storm community. And um, sorry if I haven't read your uh, comments so far. I don't normally tend to read uh, the Reddit posts I post uh, because I try to avoid negative comments. Um, it's not so much the feedback uh, related negative comments. Um, it's comments worse than that, I think, uh, that I try to avoid. And um, I don't know if I should have... I'd, for some reason, I read them today. And anyways, um, I received the feedback from a couple of you guys that um, I shouldn't post, I shouldn't self-promote my videos um, on, the, on the forum, that uh, many gaming subreddits disallow it anyways. And that I should find other means to self-promote or not do it at all. Um, the issue is that perhaps you know better or perhaps you have never made YouTube content. But as far as I'm concerned, and I've been making videos since I think like 2018, there pretty much isn't another option to... Uh, grow as a small channel besides posting or self-promoting i guess we can call it on reddit it, it doesn't even really matter like this uh, youtube channel is a side channel anyways uh, but the point is that uh, youtube is a platform that isn't great about pushing your content if you are a small channel for multitude of reasons. We could talk about this for half an hour. Now, there are other platforms like uh, Twitch.tv, you know, the streaming um, service channel, which is even worse, where pretty much the only way to find someone small is to scroll to the very bottom of a list, whereas YouTube might accidentally push your video like two years after you post it through the algorithm somehow. But... The thing is, I have not found a good way or a better way than posting on Reddit. And it was really interesting because the first two videos I posted um, did receive a few amounts of upvotes, actually, like a surprising amount, I guess. Um, and then after, yeah, the, after the third post, it's just zero. And... Uh, just a side comment, but it makes me wonder if, you know, the way it works on Reddit is if the first person who, like, you start at one, right? Um, if the first person who votes on your post is, like, negative and it goes down to zero, it's almost like people, it's like bulls seeing red and people start being negative. And then if someone upvotes it, then it's the opposite. People start being positive. Um, at first, I found it a bit ludicru uh, ludicrous that... Someone said that I'm spamming my videos and it was kind of funny because I, I made one video every day. I wasn't doing, I wasn't posting like free videos a day or anything like that. But then I realized as I'm like scrolling through the, uh, the hot topics or whatever, the issue is that, and this is by far the saddest fact in this entire ordeal, uh, the Against the Storm sub, uh, subreddit is very, very small. And it is really sad for me because 
this is one of if not the best video game that I've it's so well done and it deserves much larger recognition um, yes I'm gonna address like the discord promotional or whatever in uh, uh, soon but this is this is why it might seem like I'm like spamming because look there's like two I haven't posted yesterday two days ago three days ago four days ago five whatever I don't really I wouldn't really call it spamming but it, it, it doesn't matter uh, now those of you saying that I should be posting it onto like a discord server or whatever I honestly I implore you especially if you've never created YouTube videos or anything like that to, to try and post your content in its the, the game's uh, respective discord channel because you will have to deal with the most annoying discord mods and I'm not talking about the against I've never been to the against the storm discord channel. I'm talking about in general you will have to like apply to be a content creator and you message like one discord mod they don't reply you message another one they block you you message a third one and then okay they, they tell you how to apply and you, you fill out the application and it, it's not good and it's it, even if you post discord I don't really think many people click on the video at all whereas I have done self-promotion on reddit in a few other instances or a few other games and especially in small communities, especially older communities. For instance, I uh, created some videos uh, more than a half a year ago uh, for a game that came out like 15 to 20 years ago. And I self-promoted myself in that subreddit. And to be completely honest with you, if I didn't do that, there would have been like 10 views on each video. Uh, those were like actually like edited fairly high quality videos but it doesn't really matter and uh, when I posted it on the res the subreddit of that game by the way the game was Viva Piñata it's like a garden builder game I do recommend it I received I didn't receive that many views but from the amount of views that I received I received a lot of like positive comments and it was clear that people came from the subreddit you can even check on youtube somehow i don't remember how so the bottom line is um listen if they if they disallow in the future for me or anyone to post uh, or self-promote in the against the storm subreddit um they just have to remove my posts i guess that's fine I am not going to stop posting my content on the Against the Storm subreddit. I might check out the Discord, uh, whatever, the Against the Storm Discord, if there is, a, there's probably one, I guess, right? There's, there's a Discord for everything to see if I can post there as well. But there are a lot of gaming subreddits also that simply don't disallow self-promotion because it's, it's a little bit of a ludicrous point you want your game to grow especially smaller games and again it's just that I'm, I'm really sorry and I I'm not lying when I say that every time I post uh, I self promote I, I really cringe and I really don't want to do it and it sucks and this is why I don't read the comments on the posts no matter if they are positive or negative I just don't want to receive any feedback because it, it it cringes me so hard but until I can find a better solution I have to do it because um, producing content and again like I don't really care about this small like against the storm two siders YouTube channel I'm trying to learn the game so I can uh, create a better video for my main one but when you put effort into something and you want to share it with others, uh, you just, I'm just going to do it. And I received a lot of uh, positive comments still on like the YouTube video. I, I was surprised. Um, a couple of you left comments that, I don't know, I said something in the middle of the video and then someone commented on it. I thought that was really cool because I thought like nobody's watching these. I thought it was like 
50 bots or whatever that, that is watching the video. I um, received a lot of good tips. Um, I, I, I'm sorry if I don't read or follow the tips that you guys give me sometimes because I'm a bit of a, a perfectionist and I really try, I try really hard not to sort of, not spoil myself with the tips. I don't want to really min-max uh, right now. I want to, and I know it's ironic that I'm going to do a video about teaching people how to play the game, even though I don't want to like receive tips. But I noticed that if I, if I start reading about a video game that I really like, about how to play, play it properly or how to min-max, I just lose interest instantly. Especially if it's badly balanced. So I, I don't really want to do it. Anyways, let's get back to the game. We will reforge the... Let's check on this two, actually. <laughs> Wait. Where's this two? Okay, it's fine. Uh, let's get back to the game. Uh, sorry for wasting your time. Um, I probably should re-record this. And uh, say the exact same things in the same two minutes that I said. Now... When it comes to this uh, settlement, uh, for reforging again uh, seals, you always go to the sealed forest biome, and the issue with the sealed forest biome, woodcutters don't generate hostility, which is good, but every every 10 felled trees add to the hostility. So basically, I will want to make sure to cut as few wood as possible. I will try to not sell wood to traders either, and we will try to make a... We'll try to get buildings where we can create efficient fuel. Uh, though there, are, there is sea marrow on the map that is efficient, so we can mine that. The other issue... Look at this. Look at this. Look at the screen right now. The game effed me so hard. Because it gave me harpies and foxes. Now, obviously, this is the best choice out of these three caravans. Because it has the maximum amount of villagers. But harpies and foxes do not work with each other. Um, even with my limited knowledge of the game, I think people hate harpies the most. I think people find harpies the most difficult race. But harpies are great because you can combine them with uh, combine them with like humans and dwarves and they can share likes, like food likes or coats and the services uh, with other races. And there's a potential that you can it doesn't really happen with any other uh, race combination. There's a potential that you can triple likes. So for instance, humans, beavers, harpies, all like coats. So you can, and you wanna, you know, focus on the likes because it's easier to focus on coats than focus on like, I don't know, jerky and uh, scrolls separately. I just said something. And also you can combine it with like other stuff like uh, harpy, lizard and, uh, humans they all like pies so it's great now foxes and harpies do not share a single like besides tea and as you know tea is a service item and you might there's a high chance that you get a game you just have a game where you cannot focus on tea or you can only focus on tea at a high high price especially tea because it requires um, metal to make it's just a pain in the ass is there even metal on the map so there is copper luckily so these two the game effed me so hard we will take this but I wouldn't be surprised if we lost I'm, I'm bringing the small farm as, as usual because there is an average amount of fertile soil Luckily, I'm bringing extra wood. Like I said, we want to cut as few wood as possible. Uh, extra villagers. And then I had one. I don't know if I should bring the royal permit or meat. We, we do get 42 meat, which is better than 28 eggs. I don't even know why you get more more meat. But uh, a royal permit, re-rolling. I do want to re-roll. I don't know. Um... I don't even know what I want because woodcutters don't generate hostility, so we don't want that reroll. Uh, we don't want that cornerstone that reduces hostility. Also, the last time when we lost the game, let's start in the meantime. Again, I made the um, 
I felt like I really couldn't do anything, but uh, too many villagers were leaving, and that's why we, um, the queen's impatience got increased by too much, and we lost. Oh my god. The extra two villagers were humans. This is the best. Uh, getting lizards would have been really, really bad. Dwarves, okay, but uh, again, we don't really want woodcutters that much. Humans are insane because not only do they reveal the fertile soil location instantly, the nearest one. I haven't played in two days. It's 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 gonna be really difficult. Not only do they reveal the fertile soil location, humans do. There's a common. There's a lot of common shares. So you know biscuits, uh, pie. Um, I really like porridge because it's cheap. I'm like cycling through these buildings with the shortcuts because I never know which one to uh, that we need. We have a lot of very nice pork. Might as well cut some. Oh, and there is high chance of copper. We might as well, uh, yeah. We have a lot of workers. This is awesome. Um, I'm going to destroy this woodcutter camp. Remember that the destroying in this game uh, refunds the parts and everything. So might as well do it. Oh my god. So for every 20 felled trees, global resolve is increased by 3. Now this looks like a really bad idea. Especially with these awesome, um, I really like epic um, perks or cornerstones, to be honest. This is a really bad, it looks like a really bad idea because, we, again, we want to reduce the tree cutting as much as possible. But 20 fell trees is not really that much, so I'm not really sure how good this is in terms of numbers. Looks like a bad idea, but it depends on the math, okay? I'm still not going to take it, but again, not necessarily a bad thing. Because 20 fell trees might not be a large amount either way. Um, gaining 10 amber every time a trader arrives is so... I, I like that so much. Because I like buying uh, perks and buildings from traders. But receiving free packs of provisions is also decent. We already have a lot of villagers. Both of these are awesome. Which one's worth more? So with this, we never have to worry about creating packs of provision basically ever again. Uh, what about this one, two siders? Well, herbs. I'm gonna continue. I'm gonna focus on farms, uh, which don't uh, have herbs. They they produce grain and uh, broccoli. So I really like this one. This might be better because again, you're probably gonna get more money. Uh, through the, um, not the traders, but the trade routes, but, uh, <sighs> just pick it and go. The issue with this perk is that now we have to focus on increasing trading speed, the um, trade when traders arrive. And I don't necessarily want to do that. Oh. That's why they're not cutting into it. Should have checked. Uh, we're not going to pick it. Oh, okay. Let's assign. Harpies are not bad here because uh, they do have a speed bonus to food. That's actually decent. That's much better than resolve at this point. Uh, can we increase resolve to generate points or reputation points? No. I do want to cut into there soon. Okay, so... My... St <laughs> my stew is not boiling over. That's good. I... We see... That it's going to be here. 100%. It's like a straight line. 
and it can't be in a small glade. So we have to cut through here. So it's a good thing that we are cutting. And there's three small glades. That's awesome. We're going to cut into there as uh, soon as possible because maybe we can finish the game early. Are you see look at this I cannot place my farm there so dumb I have to place it there uh, you cannot remove this unfortunately it's in the worst possible location oh clay there's clay on the map that's nice Uh, this this map is kind of similar to the mushroom biome because there's both a stone source like clay or stone, uh, copper, and uh, you know the, the mushroom has the coal. That shouldn't have done that because it doesn't matter at this point. We have to endure the winter. I was a bit late with this small farm. I'm going to start creating only grain because it's two stars and uh, bit this water down here. Ah, too late. With that water down here, we can create, we can start create porridge. Start to start to create porridge. Nice English, bro. 30 because two things eat it. Yeah, 30. Grace is at four. Buildings are not enough because we have so many villagers. We don't have any tools because we don't have the lizard starting ability. We also don't have stone. That's the only issue with clay is that uh, stone is used to open stuff and we're not going to get any stone. Ever. Okay. Unfortunately, every storm, I almost said, I always say winter. Unfortunately, every winter we're going to get some kind of a return the slab uh, curse. Let's start cutting that way. Fortunately, this will... Uh, I don't want them to cut, start cutting that way yet. Yeah, I should have done a trading post already. Because remember, we want the 10. And I'll just destroy it later, if it's in the way. Ah, that doesn't matter. Should have done it earlier. Because we could have cut down like 2 minutes. Global production speed slow, it doesn't really matter at this point. What buildings do we have? Porridge, really, 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 really good. A clay pit could be okay to make cloves with. Are there any cloth stuff? Yeah, there is reed. Decent. Yeah, this map can be hard, but um, it has some nice resources. It has a bit of everything. Yeah, two is okay. Because uh, there is, again, um, copper on the map, but I, I do want the porridge, and the crystallized do us is decent, I guess. Forester hut can be so good. I might just pick the forester hut because then we never have to worry about copper ever again. Should have done this earlier because they can do double yields. If they were over the storm as well. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Again, with the woodcutting, you are so cheeky. This is really good rebellious spirit for impatience. You get a bunch of uh, global resolve, and we're going to increase impatience by so much, I think. It's going to be a long game. So I have to pick this one. Hostility reduced, okay, but uh, this is so good. Right now, it doesn't do anything. But soon. Uh, newcomers. Ooh. Yeah, one part, one copper bar. Sure. Okay, ten, we got 10 gold. Mushroom production, flower production, really good too. Capacity decent. Um, fuel consumption is... All, on this map, is actually really good. We also don't have dwarves. Hang on. Who is at the hearth? Boxes are useless at this point. Yeah, we have to use harpies, guys, because... Harpy ability is actually so good. Because harpies increase... Yeah, I should have done... I, I'm really bad at playing. I should have done like a expedition game or whatever before. But it's... I'm really tired. I just got home. Mushrooms. Are there mushrooms on the map? There are. Hang on. Can we like... Call into this glade before Sahil the leaves. I'm so dumb. This is why they're not cutting into it. Harpies have 17 resolve. It's so good. So no mushrooms. There is a bunch of copper. Wow. For some reason I forgot that they could spawn in mines. Berries. Too bad it's not berries, Sahilda. I'm not gonna take mushroom production, even though there's a high chance that we're gonna get like again like mushrooms for everything, grain and whatever. A flower production. Flower production is really good. Look, because we can do biscuits and pies. Also sell it. I'm not going to take building capacity for... N I don't really... Because the issue is I don't really know how much this increases global like uh, production speed by... Mm, probably by a bit, but... Fuel. Can we do 25, 15 gold? Not going to sell wood. No, uh uh We need to sacrifice a lot. Uh. That's okay. Uh, beacon tower it's too bad you can't look at what the beacon tower does i'm pretty sure we need it later for global production speed i always forget to use them in time we are peering down a geyser is there anything else we want from sahilda not really i don't want to sell more parts i don't think selling parts was necessarily a bad idea mushrooms yeah, don't work here yet. I'm not gonna pick buildings yet because again I wanna find more farmland for the crystallized dude. That would be so good. Because we can just start producing a bunch of tools, pipes, whatever we need. Uh orders Yeah. Oh sorry. That was a mistake. I should have. 19 fabric, wow.
Stonecutter's Paradise, I'm telling you. And then you gotta get like a perk where... Uh, I don't wanna place a warehouse here, because it's kind of close, though we could. Speed up farming, you know what? Let's check how much they can farm. Probably a decent amount. Because we have a lot of workers, we might as well cut a bunch right now. Okay, so there's no, like, coal making. Hang on, is there coal here? No coal. No coal in the map, I guess. Yeah, because, uh, yeah, we said there's only sea marrow. Let's get a timed order. We can already do this. <laughs> Thank you, game. Oh, and we got the best one? Is that the only one they share? It is. Tea house. That is actually so good. Global production rate. Oh. Oh my god, that is so good. We can assign. We have a bunch of workers. Might as well assign a couple. Well, moving this will be really effing annoying, but uh, it is what it is. Should place it somewhere there. At the edge, right? Oh! Webcam died. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. God, there's a part of making stew where at the very end you want to make it thick. <laughs> okay, that word. You, you want to make it thick. So you have to put in like, I don't know what it's called, but it's like a stock, I guess. Uh, made from flour and oil. And it's, it's never not a dice roll. Better, like, how much flour you need and whatever. How long you have to do it for. Let's upgrade this. So we'll see. Okay, let's let's look at how much grain they are taking. Uh, I will probably have to put in more stock to make it thicker, honestly. And it's... I guess it's still better than putting too much in because then you can't take can't really take it out you can put in water but uh... yeah, let's cut that way you can put in more water but then you can just like kind of dilute it let's get more orders more oil is decent, actually. I don't really care about this, because we can already do this, but um, if we accidentally get the druid building, we can we can make an infinite amount of grain. And it's basically free fuel, so we never have to cu cut down trees, except for free glade events. Fabric would be nice. There are no insects on the map. Oh, there are. One glade event, two glade event. But we can't even do one because there's no stone on the stupid map. How did we get sea marrow from the trees, I guess? Uh, pick up goods. Uh, let's try. Let's try really f hard. Villagers are consuming more food. Oh, literally, it's oh, drizzle of water again? Ugh. And no glade went. So that means we basically have to have to cut into here. Because there are just no glade events anywhere else.
At least we found some reed. I will connect some pipes. I don't care to the field kitchen. If you destroy something, you don't get the pipes back. I guess. I don't really know how it works. Okay, Termite Mound is so good, and maybe we should have picked that. Uh, plus one to insects order, but we didn't know. We have to do... What's plus five? Woodcutters. Don't care. Five insects per minute is so good. Now, I even would sacrifice parts for that. Now, unfortunately, there's only one Glade event here again. Let's check this. Mm, some materials, rain engines. It's similar to what we had last time. It's probably the exact same. Open or send caches. Yeah, uh, would be nice. Uh, so we are taking this for Esther's hut. Hang on. Two star harvester's camp. Nice, we already have that. Everybody has that. For Esther's hut. So we could have picked the tea doctor as well, but I don't want to deal with copper, okay? Workshop, really, really nice. Coal might even be better. Just for this map. Because we're already, already getting Weaver. Or, uh, yeah, uh, and Free Star Fabric. And again, like stuff like Lumber Mill. Um, like, to do this event efficiently. 17 parts is a lot of parts. We are getting free, anyways. Uh, like, what I'm thinking is we can pick the tool shop, uh, place down a forester's hut so we can crystallize dew fairly soon. Uh, create tools. <laughs> create tools. Create pipes for the giant eye. That's such a hard pick. I don't want to, I don't, okay, I don't want coal just yet. I'm going to be greedy, not take an efficient fuel source, because we might get the druid building or something that creates oil. Remember, we get plus one to oil. Now, workshop would be really nice. But pipes are also okay. Planks is really good too. Um, you know what? You know what? I'm stupid because I didn't freaking put down a beanery. I forgot. Bef yeah, before I left, I got a beanery. I forgot about that. Sorry. Let's see. We can do this really fast or not. Not a blight post. Kinda looks similar, but I want a warehouse. Um Stormwater Gazier is rigged. Really Let's see what we get. Plant fiber per minute, decent, but we have a bunch of reed. I saw in the corner of my eye Sahilda's, Sahilda's cookbook. I really like that, but we have no means to create pie just yet. Every time you open or send caches, hostility is lowered, but we don't. We, we, uh, 
Uh, Vafi settlements. I really want this. But uh, plant fiber. Don't care. We could also reroll. And I kind of wonder. There's a bunch of good uh, corners. So the ancient pact is on this map might not be that great because we already found a bunch of we don't want to go around the map looking for glades back to nature great would be great would be really really good yeah biscuit diet okay uh, also jerky only eaten by harpies but pie is eaten by both. We might never get pie buildings, though. We don't even have a flower building. So... Ah. I don't care. I'm gonna pick it. Okay. I really like that, but that was a mistake, by the way. Don't don't ever do that. Just reroll, please. Uh, free, free. More harpies than humans, I guess. Oh, foxes. Planting 25% faster. Actually, not that great. Uh, because of, I forgot to check the last season. Um, gathering or harvesting is, is much more important than planting. Porridge production is so good. Clay pit. Clay pit is really good. Contraband is obviously really good too, but we don't have the money. I'm not going to sell parts. Do we, do we really need clay pit? Because I am taking porridge. Do we really want porridge? Because, <laughs> hear me out. We have a bunch of water. So much water. We have a bunch of grain. So much grain. We're gonna eat, we're gonna probably get even more. Hello. Clay pit. It's just a nice way. We don't need reed. Or clay at the moment. But it's just a nice way of making sure that we never run out of bricks and cloth. But I'm not going to take it, I don't think. And then again, it frees us from a potential bad pick from, uh, you know, the buildings. Uh, oh, well. Oh, well. Just out of curiosity. Uh, clay. Clay pit. We never need copper ore ever again. We won't even be able to smelt it, I think. Uh, it's not worth much, is it? F it. Clay pit. No, to be honest, I would much rather spend my money elsewhere. Okay, we're gonna get some stuff. 11 minutes. Making 12 tools is... Uh, one minute. God, I'm so dumb.
kind of expiring at the same time. Okay, there is a glade event here. So we need to also tools for copper ore or sea marrow. And there is so much good fertile soil. Uh, how can we get sea marrow? Yeah, only wood cutting for now. Do we have sea marrow? God, man. Alala. God, man. Stone. God damn. We'll find a way. Have to. I also meat. Nice. Um, I might as well like spend parts. One of these, I guess. I decided that I'm gonna pick tool shop. Tea house. This is useless, this is useless, but this already making crystallized dew. And we have a tea house. Wait. Forgot to build this. I'm so dumb. Uh, we don't really have the workforce anyways. But um tool shop. I know we need decorations, okay? I'm just kind of concentrating on the event. Like that. It's 24. Oh, harpies. Should be really concentrating on this instead, of not the, not the stupid glade events. But it takes five minutes to do. Oh god, that that was so sad. Just about missed out. Should have put more workers there. Uh, we don't need one of the woodcutters now. We need space around here. A lot of foxes, nice. Uh, so we have nine only. <sighs> might as well start farming here. Cause this is massive. Uh, we might, we might as well, uh, cause we, no. <laughs> We need to double dip anyways, is what I'm trying to say. We don't have planks? Please? Nine. I'm not saying no in German, I'm saying four. We only, yeah, that's eight to us. We are done for. So, might as well assign the foxes nine parts. Uh, it is what it is. Do we really want to waste nine parts? Otherwise, sea marrow sucks, sucks, sucks. This sucks. 
This is free food and harmony. Not that harmony matters too much. Yeah, I know harpies. Tea house. Tea house, mushrooms. Mushrooms come from. Where do mushrooms come from? I mean, not in, not in real life. I mean, in the game. Uh. We started with, with them? What? Let's uh, prohibit eating mushrooms because I need them. How did we... It's gonna be a tough storm. Oh god, do we need to sacrifice resources? Stupid harpies are gonna leave again. But we have a bunch of uh, wood to sacrifice, I guess. Regular buffs is also nice, to be honest. I need to forget that there's a production priority on the planks. I don't need, I shouldn't forget that. Hang on, my game froze. Plague of Darkness, Storm is longer. That is so bad. Oh my god, that is the worst one. That sucks. Plague of Darkness. We cannot sacrifice because of this, the, the Plague of Darkness. Oh my god, this sucks. But even then, like, even if we had plus five. Should have known. Yeah. Ah. Uh, not much I can do, unfortunately. I can create uh, buildings for the harpies. Hi. Should have should have continued making stupid porridge. Just create porridge, create it. It's like five workers are gonna leave. Of course the cook left. This is this is exactly what I did last time. Christ, sorry for swearing, but we all should also do this. Three, three minutes, hang on. God damn, one, two. Oh, This will help us a little bit. Four. Four. Uh, we need humans more.
Wait. That was really fast. Harpy, please don't leave. Of course. Of course. Yeah, how many did we lose? Like seven. Oh god. Half reaches hundred percent corruption. I don't I never pick this, I don't wanna start now. Impatience grows three percent slower trade route. Yeah, we need to pick that. Royal Guards, Brawling, no. Half, I don't care. Fuck me. Like, I don't have the workers. Of course it left. I have to pick this one. This impatience is a bitch. Tablets. I don't have tablets. I don't... <sighs> Just to stop the impatience. Box house. <laughs> So eight minutes to get a fox house. Three minutes until drizzle is over. Oh, and it's 16. Crystallize do and then also build. We have to try. Might, might be our only chance to. Plus two coats is also nice, but I don't have mushrooms anywhere. Could find them though. T is so good though, and oh my god, five villagers. But also we get five harpies here. Just no mushrooms whatsoever. Could also get crystallized dew from the trader. That is coming. You know what, there's a high chance of double yields. Uh, on the ancient hearth, human, please. Like, right now. Twenty-five percent slower in patience is really good. Stone cutter, don't care. Folks, please come here. Unfortunately, a hearth is really far away. Oh, termites though is so good. We have to try. Wait. Four planks each. Oh my god. Thanks. If we do that, then to deactivate everything. Oh, we have berry production. I didn't notice that. Didn't check in time.
Maybe we can get a plank building, T building. I will want that. Even though flower and planks. Provisions though. Pie and coal. Pie. Take me. Yeah, we'll take this instead. Pie. So it's such a good pie building. Why must you be so cruel? Let's try. Okay, so she does sell planks. Foragers camp. Fabric. We did get the weaver. So good. Such a good amount of stuff. But we don't need plus two fabric. We have we're gonna get so much cloth anyways. Uh foragers cram uh, grain root. Uh, only for roots, but we don't have two star roots, so we're not gonna pick that. Plantation for plant fiber, not great. Plantation for berries is okay. Now that we ran out of wait, berry new year is so good. I have to get the, have to get the berry new year. At the very least. Stupid tools. I don't need tools anymore, do I? We have so much grain. Plantation is awesome. I'm gonna do a... Plantation here. Just because of the berry new year. Anyway, she doesn't sell... She doesn't sell the, the metal that we need. Crystallized do. We are going to buy like, at least like, honestly. Yeah. Um, I'm going to sell the tools. We won't need it just yet, uh, though we will need it to finish the event, I guess. Cash is opened or sent. Oh, never mind. Zero out of three. So. Free gold only. I just do this. Whatever. I don't want to like leave tools. It doesn't really matter. Probably. <laughs> Boss free to pickled goods is so good too. We can create crystallized do this way, I forgot about this, but Oh my god. Really need more workers. 
Sucks. 15 workers is not nearly enough. Can leave the field kitchen. In fact, might as well deactivate it. Let's place the fox houses. Fucking eight. Thanks, we are probably fine. Oh, Fox is nice. Didn't realize I'm stupid. Okay, trade routes. Twelve gold. We have oil. I'm gonna sell the oil. Probably shouldn't have sold it. Oh, no, never mind. We got plantation. Forgot. V the only thing we need is more workers, to be honest. Folks, please help out there. We really need more builders. Just in case, okay? <gasps> planks. Why do, why do we not have planks? Why do we not have planks? Why do we not have planks? Oh, because it's four each, not two each, you dumbass pop. Two shop. Five planks. We are fine. Come on, come on. 
Yeah, of course you are doing a tear on you dumbass. I think we'll be fine, but only because I saved so much, so many workers. I think we are f fine because we can favor the harpies, maybe. Oh my f I don't want to talk about it. Why did Resolve drop by so much so suddenly? I, I don't want to talk about it, dude. I don't want to talk about it. I, I know I'm dumb, but... I just make so many careless mistakes and I... I, can't, I cannot concentrate better. Just grain. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care anymore. I don't care anymore. King rain engines.
to bed. Do we really want mushrooms and herbs? We can just create resin from the forest or something. What am I talking about? Oh my god. Come on. Meat. I start doing this. Building materials sucks, but we, we can just use the copper. Too bad we can't use. Let's use the insects here. Training gear now. Wrench. From no, 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 no. It's more important to get a good stuff like workshop. Even a furnace would be nice, because we can create pie and bricks. Yeah, work workshop is not good because we already have weaver. Uh, supplier yeah this is much better this is so good the only problem is it doesn't give us uh fuel 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 and now you give me bakery are you serious i really wanted a uh, like a druid's hut don't need fabric should have created this first. Not this. Hang on. Bunch of crystallized do is actually nice. <sighs> Twelve amber each. This is bad. 
keeping an eye on the uh, impatience, but... Uh... Traders real life quicker is nice. Purging fire can be nice. Yeah, purging fire, like, like using water in our engines is bad. Because right now, purging fire... Creation is bad. 15% trader is decent. And wildfire essence decent. I don't actually know if multiple... I'm guessing multiple halves consume multiple. Or uh, double... Or more... Whatever. Food. 45 gold. I I'm gonna take purging fire just in case. No. I, I don't know. I literally don't know. <laughs> okay. Uh, forum scrolls. I don't. I don't. No. Still got it. Two forbidden glades. Wow. Hundred percent more woodcutter camp stuff. So we literally need. We literally. We are really good in hostility, by the way, but we really need this because this is exactly what we need to get less trees. There's one there that's really good. There's another one there. Sucks. But cutting through here and here, we have to try. Um, Yeah, uh, stop doing that. Because we need woodcutters now. And workers, uh, builders. And yeah, toolship is not super important, to be honest. Beacon tower might be great, actually. I'm just gonna place it down just in case. I forget about it. We just need to cut into glades. Useless. T Doctor is really good. Oh! Oh my god, I just came. Sorry. <laughs> Press. This is exactly what we needed. Minus five to global resolve. Are you fucking serious? That's exactly what we didn't need. Five harpies. 
Oh, it just it just got worse. Sure, man. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Why didn't it get better? So dumb. Ooh, luxury goods. It's actually decent. Bye, Harpy. Impatience grows. Yeah, of course. Of course. Dumb. I'm dumb. They are not cutting through. Thank God. Consuming more food. Double yield. Uh... Empathy. Decent. There is no impatience penalty when someone dies. Year 9. That would have been good like 4 years ago. Or uh, 20 minutes ago. Year 9. What year are we in? 6. We cannot pick that, guys. We, we cannot pick this one. 3 years. And impatience will grow 6 times there's absolutely no way we can pick that. Unlock all camp blueprints. But the gathering speed is decreased. This is bad for trees right now. Um, we'll see if we pick this one though. Probably not. half impatience points oh this is also bad because we are using up all of our freaking fuel purging fire so we need purging fire 120 seconds foxes can do it in like 330 it's like too bad that's not too bad we are getting more soil as well, but we just, we just, ah. Uh. Um, I'm going to do something crazy. Not this. I'm not gonna... Oh, so drizzle. Jesus Christ. A level 2 camp would be nice here, though. I'm not gonna cut until we get, like, uh, down to that exact. Because um, I don't want to trigger. Oh, oil is so good, though. Yeah, don't even use so much wood wasted. Jesus Christ. We had like 300 and now we have 60. <sighs> uh... I'm dumb because we could have made like 40 harpy houses by I'm so dumb I'm sorry guys I, I'm also sorry for the fox houses I'm sorry for self promotion I'm sorry for everything okay but I'm just dumb we don't have stone okay I am just oh, also should have placed the harpy houses around here That's exactly how much we need, but yeah, we don't need them here. Fucking issue is that we don't have enough harpies. Eleven. Affected eleven. 
Uh, we need to create some human houses later. Oh, eight. yeah, eight, because this, this is not going to house anybody uh, until the next newcomers, at least. Okay, so we need the blight rot, the blight post. We need this. How many? Six. God damn. Too bad we can't. Okay, so that building is using it. We need the pipes. Make like nine, at least. Make like twelve. I don't care. Uh, where is all the wood going to? Supplier. Okay, that makes sense. It's fine. Who's working at the crude workstation? Don't work at the crude workstation. Jesus Christ. Don't need the crude workstation ever again. No wonder we lost all of our stupid wood. Right. Oh god, and now we need bricks. But we can't create bricks. Oh, we can. Just about. Okay. We started with so many villagers and now we... we... It's fine. Yeah, sorry. Like a bunch of flour. Can we create pie? We can. We have to start making pie before the storm. Gain 10 amber every time a villager dies or leaves. That is so good. Oh, we can grab, we can get scrolls as well. Oh, that's so we should buy some. That's all we can do for now. Though it would be nice. Yeah, I'm gonna sell parts. Eight parts at the very least. Fuck yeah. Pigment. Woodcutter is moving faster. Twenty nine. Twenty. So good. God damn. Should have checked that first. So good. We're gonna be rich.
I need to start focusing on complex food though. Nice. Ooh, so many. We're gonna get a bunch of jerky. Seven minutes. That was so dumb by me. Okay, you can cut into the stupid glade now. Oh my god. What the fuck is that? Harp resolved by free. Instantly summon a storm. Each hostility level. Wow. Oh my god, we can tame we can feed it. Five X. This is so good, though. We're gonna get fucked by the harpies. Same time. Hostility is really high. God damn. <laughs> okay. What about here? Uh, there is a... Wow. How do we only have zero out of three caches sent? We just need a bunch of... Pies? <laughs> We don't need crystallized do. Or oh, city decreased by a hundred. Probably speed is better. Only down to fucking two minutes. Oh, 
Should have used this before. All villagers move slower. Oh, true. 26! Oh! Okay, we really need this. In the meantime, uh, start creating tools as well. Hang on. Ah! Tool shop. Welcome to the bakery. They might not even leave until the end of the storm. Uh, seven, six. Fuck, we really need more this fucking shit. Oh, fuck. Light road bullshit. Zero. Zero. How are they leaving? Huh? For each hostility level. Oh no. We're actually so fucked. Yeah, we fucked. Corruption grows quicker now. And we got an impatience point. Corruption is gonna go fucking insane. Because, fuck me, I should have waited more for the dumbass shit. Coats is nice. Tea house, I mean, fuck me. Mm 
Okay, we can send. <gasps> Just forgot about this. I almost just... Uh, fuck! Lord's hostility. Forester hot grain. Production goods. Small farm, honestly, good, but... Might as well buy these. We don't need this because we have a bunch of soil. Just need workers, packs of goods. I'm going to take packs of goods simply because of... Can we also create biscuits, please? It's really good. It's really good. Can't even put it anywhere. Four hundred percent light rot. Nope. We are on the way to losing. Hang on, buff house. Villagers leaving slower is really, really, really good.
Don't need any of these. We just need like uh, service buildings. Don't care. So nine, eight, Pigment. I should have re-rolled on uh, for corruption shit. I'm so dumb. This is actually the, the game where we needed the corruption stuff. <laughs> we didn't get it. Travel cost. It's really good, but... Uh... We don't really need anything else. Just need to do this stupid fucking... Hang on. Two hundred percent corruption. And I rerolled like seven times. How can we increase the harp's resistance? <sighs> Through here? Oh, we can do the Heart of Amber shit. Can do that one. <sighs> this is good. Bakery production.
basically like infinite. Oh. Uh, we're gonna gain reputation from resolve i i don't know if it's possible i think we said it was possible to gain more than that more than the maximum technically uh yeah we we really really needed bath house Should have done this 15 years ago. There's not enough wood. Fuck. Ancient hearth. Why is the ancient? Okay, that was just sacrifice. Blight post. No, 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 no. Um, plantation useless. Okay. We do need the woodcutters, as it turns out. Can we? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Nice. Yes. Gold. Oh god, we've done it. Oh my god, I think we've done it. 300 rainwater. Are you serious though? Okay, get on. Um, wait. Oh no, we need. We actually need crystallized dew. We actually ran out of crystallized dew now. So dumb. Crystallized do nice. Comfortable effect. Uh, T. What do we need here? Just a bunch of planks. Oh. Oh, please. Please don't. This is why we don't have anything. I hate myself. It happens all the time too. Burging fire is so good. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. We just get pipes too. Uh, the reason why I'm gonna get pipes, even though we can make it easily, it's because the faster we can. Uh, green and blue. Don't even have buildings for that shit. Okay. 
Then we need... Like that. Artisan. We don't have yellow. Of course we didn't find any yellow. We need to get as much water used as, as possible. They are making a bunch of fuel. I don't know why you are still making fuel. 20. We have enough. Yeah, 20. Oh, because I just bought some. Okay. What is this? Each newcomer has two more villagers. So good. We could use some help. Every new villager gets packs of provisions. Fortunately, we can't get the resolve up that by that much for everybody. Not even for harpies. Jesus Christ. There is a lot of resolve. Oh, wait, new? Okay. Grain production, I guess. <laughs> Level 1 harp. This is so pathetic. What I'm doing is so pathetic. Uh, we need builders as well. I don't... Let's not forget to deassign the blight post workers because I, I will cry. So good. Don't need that anymore. Almost here. Oh no, four minutes. We're not gonna get new workers until that. Oh, everybody's resolved. So good. Oh! What the fuck happened here? Forgot about this stupid event. Sis burn longer. We cannot have that. Uh, we really need. I know you are sad. Thank God for the foxes, because it would take five minutes. Oh my fucking god. Okay. Uh eleven. Eleven.
It doesn't matter anymore. I don't know what's destroying the resource nodes, but it's kind of sucky. Okay, burn the cysts, burn the cysts. Burn them. Burn them all! We need to use more water. Should have made a stupid water collector. Bunch of people died. Let's not forget about the impatience. I don't care about this. Come, cat. What if we created a... Uh, don't care. Don't care, don't care. Oh, we got it. We got it. Oh my god, that was so bad. I played so badly. Two hours, ten minutes even. Jesus Christ. So thank you for watching. I'm going to go and eat because I'm really hungry. Bye. This was awesome, by the way.